there you guys welcome back to rose wolf i i forgot to change my my socks and my shoes again i'm sorry <laughs> how are you guys doing today so this is a bit of a downer uh it's gotten cloudy um essentially i was gonna film early around like 12 like i normally do and i signed on and i saw that it was raining so i'm like all right sweet i'll just wait until later and we'll be able to catch the coelacant after 4 p.m and it'll be awesome and, you know, now it's not raining. And I bet you anything, it's gonna start raining again by the end of the episode. <laughs> Why am I cycling through my tools? There we go. Um, but yeah, how are you guys doing? So, last time we, uh... Let's see here, how much do I have right now? Right, I have it all in my inventory. We have some 300-odd thousand bells, I think. Um, so that's pretty good. We're gonna put that towards a new public works project. Not sure which one yet. I don't think I had really many replies as to which one I should do next, so I guess I'll choose. Um, no worries, though. And if there isn't one that I like, I figure we can just uh, upgrade the house, which, you know, needs to be done anyway. Hey, Pejmina. Uh, what's the latest? Oh, hey. I know this is short nose and also a little weird, but can I come over to your house right now? It's just, I've been curious about your place for a while now. It's been bugging me. What do you say? Okay, I guess. You're gonna make me stay in my house for like five minutes, aren't you? Oh boy. Okay, so we're gonna test out that theory of a whole bunch of people who said that if you lie down or sit down on something, they'll leave pretty soon. We're gonna try that today. <laughs> I guess that's our first, uh, our first thing. Okay, pow, I'm in. Kidders. Alright, so you you take a look around my really messy house. This house is very juicy, train. Alright, so I'm gonna go lie down now. Please leave. <laughs> we'll see how long this takes her. Okay, so I'm gonna confirm that this doesn't work. Um, at least with the bed, maybe it would with the chair, I don't know, but uh, no. <laughs> Could you? You know what, Pajmina? You're alright, but we need to go. <laughs> oh my goodness, that's so frustrating when they ask me to do that. I really hate it. It just. Like, if I have multiple rooms, they leave pretty much the second they've seen all your rooms, but if you don't, like, they stay forever, and it is so annoying. I hate it, I hate it, I hate it. Alright, anyway, <laughs> let's, uh, let's continue going. Pajamina, don't you dare ask me again. I love you, but no. Okay. Oh, Poppy! Don't you dare ask me either, I love you too much. Uh, let's talk, dude. I was trying to open my door with my foot, and I stubbed my toe. It hurt so much I cried, but I still want to learn how to do chores using only my feet. It's a long-term goal of mine. You... You have hooves. Not toes. You... you have... oh my goodness, okay. We have a confused horse on our hands. O'Hare, how you doing? Uh, what's the latest, dude? Crystal, perfect timing. If you're seeing Pajmina today, could you deliver something to her for me? Oh, I just saw her for about, like, you know, five hours in my house. She did what you do, O'Hare. I'll take care of it. I know exactly where she is. Okay, let's, uh, let's go find Pajmina real quick. Oh, right. That was a fast little side quest type thing. Side quest. I've been playing too much Zelda. I'm sorry. Uh, delivery here for you. There you go. Oh, um, probably clothing. Oh, I was wrong. Oh well, I didn't really want anything extra anyway. Okay, back to finding fossils. I feel like all the villagers want us to do something. 
today, which is kind of funny. You know, still hoping that Willow and Freckles decide to move out, but so far, you know, no dice at all. Like, they haven't even hinted that they want to leave. There's a, there's a fossil for the day. Or I should say our first one for today. I'm sorry if I'm kind of out of it right now, you guys. I'm a little bit tired. But it's alright. I should have filmed this earlier, really. <laughs> but uh, that's my fault. That's totally my fault. Freckles, you want to leave? Uh, I want to chat. I'm ready to make a change here in my house, Freckles. It needs a new splash of style. You've got great taste. How about you find a cool piece of furniture for me? Do I? I don't have any furniture. Okay, I was just going to give her whatever I had in my pockets, but I guess not. I guess we're going to have to find something special for her. You know, I really like that lighthouse there. Oh, you can't really see it when I turn down. I think that looks really cool. I'm happy about that. <laughs> Which is good, because I I like where the roost is, I like where that is, but that fountain, no, oh, I hate it. Still hate it, still need to work on it. Maybe we should spend money on demolishing it. Oh, there's a thought. I don't know, I want to do that with your guys' permission sort of thing, so... Maybe we'll do that next time? I don't know. It depends on what we choose to do today, if we're even going to do a public works project, how much it costs. We probably have enough to cover everything though, so... Okay, nothing there. What are you buying today? A tiger beetle, alright. And the... Yep, the clock is about to turn over. Okay, don't see any more fossils down here. I should probably start breeding tulips at some point again. No, nothing there. Also, we're gonna have to think about doing our March fishing and I guess bug hunting episode soon, which should be fun. Or I could do it on stream. I'm not exactly sure. See, streaming sounds a bit better for that because I'm not really like, you know, pressed for time. I can stream for however long I want. Uh, whereas in an episode, I'm kind of stuck to, you know, around 30 odd minutes. <laughs> Wolfgang, you don't know, dude, how close you came to moving out. I'm just gonna... Ooh. Just gonna point that out. You could have been gone, like, forever ago. <laughs> awesome. It's been a while since we were able to do that. How much pocket space do I have? Oh, I have plenty. Awesome. Okay. So many money bags in our in our pockets. <laughs> Wolfgang, what's up, dude? Uh, what's the latest? If you like my plays, feel free to copy its look. I could live with all, without uh, all the gyroids, dude. <laughs> Not really my favorite things ever. Okay, well there's the lower half of our town covered. How many? We've only found like, yeah, one fossil, right? Wow. Hopefully the game is kind of drunk again and that it places all the fossils next to each other so it's easy for me. Uh, but I don't know if we're gonna get that lucky. Oops, there's one. Man, it is so gray and dark and I'm like hoping that it starts to rain. I believe the weather can actually change uh, every 15 minutes. So the second it goes to 5.15, there's a chance it may start raining, is all I'm saying. Um, but that would leave us very little time, right? So I don't know, you guys, I don't know. <laughs> It'd be cutting it a bit tight, but at the same time it could also change to like clear skies or you know moderately clear skies, which wouldn't be uh, that great for what I wanted to do today. Okay, well here's our roost. We should probably actually go in there and get a coffee. We want to befriend roost or rooster, rooster. <laughs> 
Uh, and that is pretty much the way to do it. What's up, dude? Uh, one, please. Uh, yeah. See, he's he recommends that you drink it before it cools. He doesn't like it if you let it cool, basically. He's pretty much the same as Sable. We're trying to befriend him, right? Uh, so, now that's a good cup of coffee, if you don't mind having to spend a few days recovering from it. Blech. No offense, Brewster, I love you, but blech. Okay, will he talk to us? Welcome. Okay, nothing really much to say yet. But he's kind of shy, so that's alright. Still have to fix this tree. I meant to also do stuff with the silver shovel today. But, uh, I don't know. We'll see if we have enough time after deciding public works projects and and stuff like that. It would be really nice, and I don't know exactly where I do this, but it would be very nice to have just a section showing off all of the different uh, stumps you could have. But I don't know exactly how or where I'd want that. Um, so we already found all the fossils for today, so we don't even have to worry about that. I'm just looking around for... Villagers I haven't spoken to yet, that kind of stuff. Dropped items, though there doesn't seem to be anything. Okay. Please take some of these. We have, I think, uh, five or six fossils left. I counted during the stream, so I can't remember exactly off the top of my head, but I do know that we have a couple more left, so it'd be nice if you could take, like, all of these, please. <laughs> it's probably not gonna happen, but you know, <laughs> I can always, uh, hope. Nope, all right. <laughs> Gosh darn it. Animal Crossing RNG gods are just <laughs> against me, clearly. Okay. So, after the episode's done, I will update the dream address as I usually do. Or, I mean, not update the dream address, I mean update the dream so you guys can see the newest going on in uh, Rosewood. I keep almost saying Rosewood. It's it's an issue, you guys. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys are enjoying being able to visit the towns. I also recently updated Rosewood if you guys are interested. I think the latest Dreamtown episode has the updated dream address on it. So uh, there's always that. It also will probably be in the description to this video, so... <laughs> Just in case you guys are curious. <laughs> Oh yeah, 39, or uh, 390 rather, uh, thousand bells, that's pretty good. Soon to be just a little bit more than that as well. Ah, oh, 21,000, alright. Okay, so... I can see Freckles having some one of these, right? I'm gonna get it for her. Just because I want to get her something. I don't want to forget about her again, sort of thing. Kind of happened last time. <laughs> so, I'm not exactly sure which public works project I want to put in yet. I was considering, like, a clock or, or a bench, maybe, but... I don't know, I don't know, we'll see. Um... If I put in a bench, I'd really like to put one in here, but I also want to have houses through here eventually. Just all lined up like that, so... I don't know, we'll see about that one. Um... Okay, good, she's still home. Freckles, do you... do you want this? Okay. 
Okay, well, she seems pretty happy with it. Take my work shirt. All right, so <clears throat> I don't know if she's that close with us yet, but we're getting somewhere. I'm very sorry about my voice, by the way, you guys. I think I may be coming down with a cold. I've been kind of feeling weird for the last few days. So uh, we'll see. Hopefully not, because I do enjoy filming these and everything on, on time and everything. Uh, all right, let's see here. How about we go look into public works projects right now? Watch the- mmm. Hmm. No, you know what? We'll look into it first, then we'll go shopping and stuff after. Oh, Flora! What's up? Oh hey, I wanted to talk to you about something. I'm thinking- <gasps> Ooh! Mmm. Okay, see, I wanted Willow or Freckles gone first, but she is in a spot where I want to put a bridge. So I have absolutely nothing against her, but I'm not going to prevent her from moving away. Hopefully she goes through with it. The 17th of this month seems like super good timing for me. Anyway, I was worried about telling you, but there it is. Uh, oh, that seems so cold. I feel bad. Bye. Thanks for that, Crystal. Now I know I'm doing the right thing. Okay, please don't hate me. Alright, so I can't talk to her again or else she might change her mind. But, uh, yeah, if you guys want Flora, I'm gonna be auctioning her off or raffling her off for free. Probably through the Discord, it's just the easiest way to do it. Um, and then on the 17th, whoever wins could come pick her up, I guess? I'm also currently auctioning, or I keep saying the wrong word, raffling off Annalise from my other town. Uh, who asked to move. She's going on the 14th. So if you guys are interested, just a little reminder. Again, only on the Discord. It's just easier for me to get in contact with people that way. Oh. Oh, sure. Normally I'd say no right now, because we're kind of pressed for time, but it's Brewster, right? I can't say no to him. <laughs> No. That path is gonna bother me so much. Oh! Brewster, your wings don't even clap together. How are we making noise? <laughs> I don't think anyone's paws or hooves or wings touch, actually. Uh, hooray for everyone! There we go, that's done with. You know, I'm I'm not gonna lie, like I like Flora. She's a very interesting looking villager and I think she's pretty cute, but man am I happy she's gone. She her house is in a bad place if I want to put a bridge there, which I do. So uh, I hope somebody else really does want her though and really uh, takes care of her, because she is a nice villager. I have nothing against her. Okay, let's try this again. Uh, public works project, please. Uh, start a new one. Alright, let's take a look here. Could we put a bridge there right now? Oh, but you, um, I don't know. I really want red brick bridges. Those are the ones that I always, always, always use. Um, I mean, I guess I could go against the curve and not do that. I could just use... Because I try to match my paths to my... Uh, be or benches, <laughs> bridges. Ah, uh, and I prefer red brick paths too, right? Mmm. You know what? Let's go try putting it down. We have enough bells. We'll see if either Willow or, uh, uh, but, uh Flora <laughs> is in the way. Because I know that they are technically, I just don't know if they're that close to the edge to be in the way. Because it, ni it would be nice not to have to loop all the way around to here, pretty much, to uh, cross over. If you guys can look down the map and see, you know, what I mean by that. Um, alright, let's go test this out then. Okay, so, theoretically, I'd want it, like, right here, right? 
Oh, hi, Pete. <laughs> I didn't mean to talk to you, dude. Okay, come on, dude. <laughs> I'm sorry, dude. Um... What do you think? Mmm, mmm. Like, yes, it's in the middle of that center of, of that bit up above, but it's so close to Willow's house and I don't know- Actually, you know what? She's leaving anyway. I like that spot. <laughs> I'm done. Understood. Well, let's go ahead and start the new preparations. All set to help us gather donations, blah blah blah. Uh, by the way, including this new one, we can have a total of three bridges. Alright, so we cannot build anymore. Alright, thank you, Isabel, for being nice about that one. Alright, let's pay this off entirely. <laughs> And, uh, next time we play, we'll have a brand new bridge over here that we can, uh, run up and down. So, 128,000 bells. Okay, awesome. Um, I'll, I'll deal with paths tomorrow, I guess. Or, you know, during the next Let's Play episode. We'll see how that goes. Um, let's go shopping right now, because we have a lot of bells. And after that, I think I want to put the remainder of these bells into our home loan. Um, I forget how much it is exactly, so I'm not sure if we can pay it off entirely, but if not, it will be a really large chunk taken out of it, so that should be good. Hello there. Um, this theme is really nice, the wood theme, but I don't know about it. I, I don't know. Okay, I definitely don't want the kitty series. And a lab floor. You know what? No, you know what? I, I think I like the modern wood. It's one I haven't gone with before, and it would kind of fit the external of the house that I already have. Minus the minus the roof. I need to fix that blue roof. <laughs> yeah, why not? I might change my mind again later, but that's just me. Okay, so let's do our usual shopping stuff, see if we can, I guess, further help us along to getting Shampoodles unlocked. Alright, so what flowers do you have for me today, dude? A white rose bag. I shall put it on my beach. <laughs> and, please be a lily, please be a lily. Oh, awesome! I like lilies. <laughs> and this. Okay, let's go see if they have any uh, clothes, shoes, accessories, etc. that we might want. I think I saw a villager in a dream town wearing something that kind of looked like that. It might not have been that exact thing. Um. I want to give this to somebody. Yes. Not to mention I need to buy more stuff like that. Um. See, that's the problem. I really don't want any of this. I'm gonna take this because it's kind of cute and it would be really cute in the fall, but other than that... <laughs> okay. Maybe we'll find some, like, proper shoes that, uh, aren't so bright. <laughs> uh, it kicks today. What are these ones? Black rain boots. Ooh, I want that. That actually be really cute right now, considering it's kind of gray and rainy. So I'm gonna put those on right away. 
There we go. And I should probably change my stockings because my legs look orange. How about these ones? And these ones. That might actually go a little bit better with what I'm wearing. But we will uh, definitely keep the uh, rainbow socks because those are like my favorite sock item ever in any video game. I think that they're adorable, just not, not with this outfit. Okay. So there's that all done. What we should do now is probably go talk to Shrunk and get our uh, emote for the day. <laughs> but how much room do I have in my pockets after buying all that? Uh, very little. Okay. Um. Okay, and... Oh, wait a minute. <laughs> my bad, I was putting them here anyway. Um, let's see here. See, this area is really overpopulated with trees. Can I fit something in? I don't think I can fit something in there, but maybe here? I'm gonna try it. Hopefully that grows up to be something. Um, let's see here. I have so much stuff here. Alright, you know what? I'm gonna have to leave one piece of fruit behind, but that's okay. Fruit trees, fruit trees, pear- or peaches. <laughs> I was looking at the pears, but I went for the peaches. Anyway, I'll leave that there. I'll pick it up in a little bit. Dude, do you want a peach? Oh, sunniness, all right. Here's a fun little fact for you. There's nothing more important to a comedian than a big smile. Even if you have an ugly mug, we need you need to have a big smile. Uh, there's nothing that charms people more than smiles on faces of any shape or level of attractiveness. That's why I'm so good at capturing the hearts of my audience. Want to see how a pro does it? Here's a taste, so watch closely. Thank you, thank you. Dr. Shrunk is in the house. Huh? It's not working. Oh. <laughs> oh gosh, his jokes are so incredibly lame, but we need- we need the emotes. Okay, so let's- let's see here. Yeah! That's one I actually use when I'm visiting people uh, on stream and such, or playing with people, so that's actually really nice to have that, finally. Okay. So, maybe let's- actually, you know, let's- let's see if Nook's home, see if he has maybe a roof that we want. Um... No. No, I'm looking for something darker than that. I don't like any of this, actually. Okay. Well, guys, I think I'm gonna have to end this episode here. Unfortunately, the rain didn't happen, although it's still pretty darn cloudy up there. Um, maybe in a future episode, in fact, for sure in a future episode, I do want to catch the seal can't and all the rare stuff like that with you guys. But, uh, yeah, thank you guys very much for watching. Thank you very much for putting up with my failing voice here. And, uh, I hope you guys have an amazing day, and I'll see you guys next time.